What is going on guys and welcome on into the channel. We are diving into NEO, a very important video here today because we have some significant chart developments, some significant technicals to talk about when it comes to NEO and the stock sell off. Across the board, we've talked about this stock for months. And if you look across the board, we just see buy after buy from analyst ratings. And the consensus here is now a $60 price target on NEO, which would be over 100% upside from the current levels over the next 12 months. The reality here is that despite these analyst price target upgrades and high price targets over the past year, NEO has done nothing but consolidate and sell off further over the past six to 12 months. We want to talk about what's going on. We'll talk about the chart. We'll talk about our key levels and where we could see a bounce on NEO. But we also want to cover NEO Day. So basically what happened here is NEO Day is now past us, right? And this is one of those catalysts that we've seen over the past couple of years that starts to get investors interested in NEO. And it could definitely help lead to a little uptick in the stock price. Uh, we've seen it, you know, run ups in anticipation of NEO Day, you know, sell the news, buy the rumor, those types of events. But what we essentially got here from NEO Day is they're unveiling a new model that's going to start deliveries next September. So we got some time for that. On top of that, if we scroll down, we talk about what analysts are saying. They're saying that as we speak right now, the risk reward is actually very attractive, but they're going to need more positive catalysts regarding their monthly sales and what and so forth, right? to kind of kickstart NEO and, and get this going back in the positive direction. Because a lot of Chinese stocks right now, to be honest, investors, basically the current climate right now, no one really wants to buy that dip. It seems like across the board. And those who do, you know, have been getting taken to the woodshed, as we like to say, right? So let's dive into the chart. Here is the chart on NEO. We have this downtrend right here from the highs earlier this year in January. And that has been met right on the way down. And right now that downtrend, if we were to go straight up from here, that's roughly around $40 per share on NEO. We're below the 200 period simple moving average, the 50 period simple moving average, which tells us that we are with negative, we're, we're moving with some negative momentum. Right? We're moving to the downside. We just broke below the low support that we had from this past year which was down around $30 per share. We have now broken below that, and now we're sitting at $28.16 per share as we speak. A pretty nasty day across the board. The stock really kind of just fell off, uh, and it didn't really close up towards the highs. It didn't really kind of make a big surge towards the end of the day. It kind of closed down towards the lows. Not at the lows, but pretty close, about you know 20 to $0.30 cents off from those lows, which at the end of the day is definitely not a bullish signal. But we got to start looking back to the left, okay? We got to start drawing some lines. So where do we consolidate and dip down to last time as we were down at these levels? You got to go back to October of 2020 to get back to kind of some of these supports that we're looking at for NEO. So we had this low right here at 25.43 on NEO. We had this high right here at around 29. So we're looking at this kind of range. And down towards this 25.43 also lines up with that 25 psychological level that you could see some buyers coming in. It's kind of a nice quarter. It's nice and easy, you know, round number. It might, makes it nice and easy for someone to say, hey, I'm going to buy at 25, right? So we can kind of see that 25 become a psychological area of support for NEO. But there's also a gap right here on the chart. So I do want to draw this gap in. And it's crazy because at the time you may have thought, well, there's no way this gap ever gets filled on NEO. And here we are a little over a year later, and it's very possible that this gap gets filled. That's the gap, okay? So this gap we're looking at right here, we have kind of a gap up one day on NEO. It looks back back in mid-October of last year. And that gap's from about $22.50 up towards about $23.50. So about a dollar a gap. So if we're looking at targets to the downside, you know, that's kind of what we're, I'm looking at right now on NEO. You know, this 25 and then down towards this 2250 to 2350 range is that gap fill to the downside. Now, not all gaps have to get filled, but many gaps do. I want to say it's somewhere to the order of 80%, but that's kind of an area to watch. So we're speaking right now, NEO is obviously selling off. And uh, if you're a longer term investor here or even, you know, a short term kind of swing trader, 
yeah, the risk reward starts to get very attractive, especially now uh, in my eyes, under $30 per share. We could certainly see some more downside, both an EV company that is progressing with new models and new stuff going on. Um, we'll have to see how things play out over the course of the next couple of months, next couple of years, obviously. That'll be a bigger story uh, in terms of their deliveries, but this is definitely getting very attractive the further down this stock goes for sure. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Like always, we'll have to regain that $30 area of resistance and hold above that. If we can do so, that's a good sign for NEO. If not until then, right, that's kind of our key level. That's going to be our resistance back to the upside. Again, there's a technical analysis trading course linked down below if you want to learn how to do your own technical analysis, chart your own stocks, build your own trading plans, key levels, all that good stuff, indicators, plus bonuses on fundamentals. Take a look at that if you're interested. We'll also leave links down below to Weeble, which is this platform right here. Get five free stocks plus five bucks in free crypto when you sign up. Other links and resources in the description box down below, as well as links to our other channels. If you like us here, check us out on our other channels for free content there as well. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.